Tonight, a family is desperate for justice after their son, Brandon Jones, was gunned down while working as a security guard at a party. South Fulton police just released the photo of the man they're looking for nearly six months after the shooting. Delvecchio Upshaw is wanted in connection with the murder of Brandon Jones in June at a house on Union Road, which is owned by a former NFL player. A News Edge reporter, Alexa Liaco, joining us live from the South Fulton Police Department with what Jones's family has to say about the hunt for the shooter. Alexa. Well, Deidre Carey, I spoke with Brandon Jones's brother who says he's relieved that South Fulton police have released the photo of the suspected shooter Del Vecchio Upshaw. He says he just hopes this helps bring his brother's killer to justice before he hurts anyone else. Brandon was 22 years old. You know, he had his whole life in front of him. He had plans to go to the police academy. All those plans cut short when Jones was gunned down while working security at a house party on Union Road back in June. I guess an argument ensued after the party was over when they were trying to get people to leave. The guy left and came back and he shot the first person he saw, which was Brandon. Now, South Fulton police say this man, Del Vecchio Upshaw, is wanted in connection with Jones's murder. It was kind of bittersweet because, you know, we were, we were excited and happy that the picture was released and the rest of the public can know what this guy looks like. They can know what he looks like. But we were also upset because we've been trying since June 12th, June 13th to try to get these pictures released. Brandon's brother Ryan says the last six months without any answers have been excruciatingly painful. Every day is a challenge. You know, I'm not going to sit here and tell you it's not. You know, I cry every day. My mom cries. My wife cries. You know, my kids cry. You know, they miss Uncle Brandon. The Jones family is hoping this photo, plus a $10,000 reward for information leading to an arrest and conviction, will bring some sense of closure. Brandon can't go to school. He can't be a, he can't be a, a police officer or a deputy sheriff because he was killed for no reason. We can't start to grieve until this guy's caught. He's a threat to the community and he needs to be off the street. And Brandon's brother has also started a scholarship fund in his brother's honor to help young people pursue their dreams of going to college like Brandon always hoped he would do. Live at the South Fulton Police Department, Alexa Liaco, Fox 5 News. Alexa, thanks.